Welcome back to our channel. Welcome to another day of Vlogtober. I don't know what day it is because I don't know when this is going up, but welcome back to another day of Vlogtober. In today's video, we're gonna be making these cookies. I'm super excited. We got this at Target and it's a Mickey Halloween cookie kit. My sister actually made these. If you guys haven't seen her video yet, you guys should definitely go check it out. I'll leave her video linked so you guys can see how her and, her and her fiance made these cookies. And I'm actually happy that she made these before me because she gave me some tips. <laughs> so she was kind of like the guinea pig, I guess. Are you ready? Vanessa's gonna help me. I'll probably, um, she's gonna do all the decorating actually because I'm not good at that. I do not have the patience for that. So I really wanted to get this mainly because it comes with a Mickey cookie cutter. And I just wanted that because then you can always use it again in the future for, you know, more cookies. So that's what it looks like. It's just a plastic cookie cutter. And it comes with, let's see. You have a piping bag for the frosting. Um, I think this is dye. Here's the cookie mix. White icing. And... Yeah, I think this is the dye, huh? Yellow, blue, red, and black. So, step one, prepare. Adults, grease baking sheet with cooking spray or use a silicone liner. Wash the cutter in warm soapy water and dry thoroughly. Kids, be sure to wash your hands. Cooking can be messy work. You might want to wear a smock or apron. Mix. Kids, combine cookie mix, butter, and egg in a large mixing bowl. Mix until well combined. Form doughs into a ball and place on floured surface. Divide dough evenly into three parts. Form a well in the center of each dough ball and place each into a separate mixing bowl. Create orange, purple, and green colored dough by following the chart below. So you have to mix the colors in order to make the other colors. Are you ready? Yeah. I'm gonna get all the bowls. It sounds like we need a lot of bowls. Here. You think this is good? Like, this small bowl? And then we'll just get like other regular bowl? Yeah. I washed my hands. Okay. We have some bowls. My sister did give me a tip and she said to make the dough first and then put it in the fridge for about 10 minutes because she said it's very sticky. Do you have to use an, a hand mixer? Um, I don't know. <laughs> so we have our bowl here with the cookie mix and then combine cookie mix butter and egg um how much butter you will need for the cookies four tablespoons so i have my butter here that's already softened it's already at room temperature Maybe I should open it first because it's very soft. I'm just going to put in about half because one stick of butter is eight tablespoons. So we have half. I'm going to save that for the frosting. Divide the dough evenly into three parts. Okay guys, so we have our dough right here. Um, now we're gonna divide it into three. So. Does that look good? Mm -hmm. Okay, so we have three balls of dough. Now we have to color them, right? Yeah. So it says form a well in the center of each dough ball and place each into a separate mixing bowl and then create the colors. Okay, Vanessa. Yes. You gotta create the colors, okay? Okay. So to create orange, you need half of the pink color. So put half of this and then half of yellow.
Okay, so we're gonna put these in the refrigerator for a little bit and we'll come back. We got the dough out of the refrigerator, but before we roll everything out, I wanna make the frosting. So we have our mixing bowl here and use an electric mixer, beat the room temperature butter. Okay, so I'm taking the rest of my butter, the other four tablespoons. Thank you. You're welcome. So we'll beat the butter until it's fluffy. <laughs> now I'm gonna add the frosting mix to my butter. It's black. Black mix. Yeah, the frosting is black. Oh yeah. Here you go. Add the frosting mix and powdered sugar. One cup, right? One cup mm -hmm. of powdered sugar. Is powdered sugar the thing you put on the beignets? On the what? Beignets. Yeah, you put them on the beignets. Okay, and then. I, I just taste it a little bit. Wow, it's warm. You really have to put it on low. And now the milk. Tablespoon. It doesn't look like it's gonna do anything. You never know. It's making it into frosting! Oh, wow. It's working! I can't believe that one little tablespoon did this. I know, I was like, mm. Wow, it's really black. One tablespoon's not gonna do nothing. What color do you wanna do first, orange? Yes. Okay. So cool. Okay, I'll roll it and you cut it. Okay. It goes like this. How much did they want it to be in? I don't know. Three sixteenths of an inch. Yeah. I'm just gonna just gonna do a thin okay. Put try to do two. Okay. Oh, it's only gonna do one. Yeah. Do I, uh, yeah, okay. Did you get it? Mm-hmm. Okay. Oh God, Look at the so Mickey. Cute. Can you guys see it? <laughs> Mickey. Okay, so we're just gonna cut all of the cookies out. Oh yeah, you can totally get three. One. Two. There you go. I'm puzzled. Okay, so here are the cookies all cut out, ready to go into the oven. I I don't know if I made them the right thickness. I think they might be too thin because the box says it makes 10 cookies and I have way more than 10. So we'll see how these turn out. We just took the cookies out of the oven. Mm. They smell good, huh? Yeah, they look like a perfect size. So Vanessa is going to decorate the cookies. Uh, we have the frosting, the black frosting, and then we have the icing, the white icing.
here are the cookies that Vanessa decorated. They look so good. Don't they Thanks. look so good? Should we do a taste yeah. test? Okay. We have AJ and Vanessa here oh, yeah, for the taste good. test. I'll try this one. Cookie cheer. Cheers. Mm. Are they good? Mm -hmm. They're so thin, huh? They're crisp. Yeah. They're kind of crispy. I like them. But the flavor is good. Mm -hmm. Okay, guys. So that's the end of today's video. I hope you guys enjoyed our video. If you did, please give it a thumbs up. And we'll talk to you guys in our next one. Bye, everyone. <laughs>